This is NDTV. And you're watching NDTV Hindu. Workout victim welcomes Idea Cellular to Chennai, and this episode is going to take Chennai by storm! It's a top selector, shot like this could have never missed! <laughs> Hop, a hippie to the hippie to the hip hip hop and it don't stop. Yeah, that's right. On Workout Victim today, we are going to beat the S word, stress. And we are going to do that by up jumping the boogie to the bang bang boogie with a hippity hopping hip hop dance class. <laughs> No viewers, I mean, trying to know me. Um, I am the simple man, just coming to Chennai for simple reasons, just you know, trying to change the world for the better, uh, and also do some cultural things here in Chennai while I'm, you know, here for ten months. So, doing the yoga, I'm playing some mandolin. On the victimometer, David ranks. Flip flops. Will this American cowboy from Jersey be able to break it down in Chennai? Well, David is waiting in the coffee shop as we speak, but in just a couple minutes, he's gonna be up on this dance floor dancing till the break of dawn. Yeah, the surprise ambush was uh, interesting. Uh, it was definitely a little bizarre, a little perturbing. I was a little weirded out. Um, but, you know, I was sort of excited to do something different, as always. So, you know, it could have been hip-hop, it could have been, you know, going goose chasing. I don't know, but I was down with it, yeah. Peeps was jumping and the action was pumping when Dave and I walked into Coquilla's hip-hop dance class. Right, we've been running the hip-hop class for the past three years now. When we started, we started more of a freestyle class because a lot of people didn't know what hip-hop was. And then um, I got the syllabus down from the States and we mixed it with some of the syllabus out of the UK as well. And so we run now proper hip-hop classes which starts with a nice good warm-up, goes into the popping and locking of hip-hop and a few flows, but that only comes towards the intermediate levels when the students have, you know, got the moves and stuff, and that's when we do the, you know, the floor work and stuff. And these are certified by the UKA London. So Dave is successfully busting a move. I think this is going to improve his luck with the ladies in Chennai. What do you think? Hip-hop culture evolved in the late 70s in New York City and was predominant amongst African and Latin American communities. The four main elements of hip-hop culture include rapping, MCing, urban-inspired art like graffiti, and dance, notably breakdancing. When we first went into the studio, I was actually impressed with the energy of the students here. I mean, you know, they really got into it. I saw some good moves and it was a good vibe. So I just, you know, figured I'd get down with it and pull some mom moves out. When 
Uh, when David walked in, well, I thought, oh my God, is this boy going to be able to complete the class in one day? Because we've got students who've been there for like six months and are still struggling. So I thought, oh my God, is David going to be able to complete a whole class when he lasts through the class? But he did pretty well. I mean, the warm up and stretch I know is tough initially for everyone. It takes your body a while to get used to that. And picking up the moves, well, he got it, not completely, but he got it and he was able to cope with the class. So he did quite well. Hi, well, it looks like Snoop Doggy D and I are ready for the real Bang! Up next, Dave and I go head-to-head -head in the ultimate dance-off. 